Peter Dean has only ever given away one of his artworks to a band in Manchester called the Lottery Winners. For the rest of the paintings, they've been hidden away in his furniture studio. He started painting during lockdown in 2020. Creativity was killing me and being at home, I didn't have the studio, so just, just in the back garden, it was a nice summer, wasn't it? So it was like, yeah, do you know what? And then away we went. But I've hidden them away for about, I think a year they've been hidden. You know, I've, I've never, the first time I've ever shown them, like in public, so. Peter's artwork is now on display at the Langworthy Cornerstone Centre in an exhibition which is currently running until the 27th of May. The organiser, Tony Eason, started the event to allow artists to display their work. We're not judging, it's not a competition. It could be a squiggle, it doesn't matter. Somebody has took the time to do some artwork or to do their form of artwork, then decide to put it in there. Only one condition. For that moment, for that time of the uh, while they're in the show, they are a lad or a lassie from Salford. The exhibition originally started as just Tony and a few of his friends, but since then more artists have joined. There's so much heart in Salford about this, and this is from the heart of Salford. Like Peter, many others were anxious to hang up their creativity on the wall. It's a wonder I can stand up, my knees are knocking, everything's going, I'm just so nervous. Suffering with rheumatoid arthritis hasn't stopped artist Roy Zamet from showing off his pieces for the first time. In fact, his condition is his inspiration for painting. You get lost in it and end up at looking up and it's four o'clock in the morning. So. <laughs> Talking to the artists at the event showed me that it doesn't matter your ability or how old you are. If painting is something you want to try, then you can. As artists hung up their paintings, there was a sense of pride and joy all around. Whether it be good or bad, I'm, I'm kind of happy for people to look and go, oh, I don't like that, you know, it's a bit, that's a bit strange. But even that reaction is, is a good one. And then other people who actually get it and look and go, no, actually, do you know what? I get that, I like that. Holly Luscombe, Salford Now.